belongs to each of them and projected on an augmented reality layer. This means that the new layer created is like stick and hang over. I can move myself and you will see that it's like a real layer that is stick over there and I can move or touch. This means I can work hands-free. This is the real power of smart glasses in comparison with other technologies. So, why it's useful such an application? Imagine a big building with uh, uh, tens of meters, and I have to work on one, a precise one. The application can drive, I can see the exact one on which I have to work without problems, without uh, mistakes, and having my tools on hand. Then, uh, when I see the one, I can select it, and having more details for the data set. For instance, here there's the daily power consumption, but any data present on the center systems may be shown well even on this way, and I can get closer to see better the graph, the schema, <coughs> sorry, or whatever. Now I will shut down this one. You will see it's still going on. I will deploy my smart glasses because I want to show how the same application, I beg your pardon, I need just the table. The same application, and now you will see projected on that monitor that it's replying my smartphone, is running over the smartphone. So you see that with this engine, it's immediately recognized and detecting the QR code, I get the data at once. This is a broken one, for instance. And again, this helps me to work and be sure of the precise smart meter I have to work with. Uh, we did a great job working on the TensorFlow engine to detect at this speed. Last but not least, about the augmented reality application based on this engine, I have another one for people who can see. Again, I beg you to look at the display because it's easier and bigger. When it comes up, I have a shape. And if I set it on the smart meter, it's recognized. And here I have the three model of the meter oh, wow. that it's capable to be navigated to get closer. And now it opens itself. The screw comes out. And after this, slowly, the first part of the shell did not come out. And I'm able, this is like having it so I can move, I can get closer, see how it's made. In this case, of course, this is not related to the specific electronic meter, but to this specific model. This will help us a lot because the, nowadays there is a campaign of substitution with new generation electronic meter and who doesn't know how to unmount or mount it can again have information on the page. So well, later on I'll be glad to show you